the British royal family are doing their bit to entertain you. When the Duke and Duchess of Sussex gave up their royal duties, it was both the culmination of a briefing war and the start of a new one. Buckingham Palace is now investigating accusations of bullying by Meghan and Harry says his fear of the destructive press intrusion that plagued his mother is now being repeated on his wife and that's partly what drove him to leave the UK. Where is the right and wrong in this family saga and what does it tell us about the nature of modern monarchy and racism in the UK? Steve, how worried should the royal family be about any bombshell revelations with this Oprah Winfrey interview? Well, they're evidently worried because uh, elements of the institution have been briefing intensively against the duo who have given the interview. So clearly there is a capacity here for further storms in the way there was during the sort of Diana era when she started speaking out in quite extraordinary ways. So they're obviously concerned. It's so interesting, the nature of celebrity and fame. I've always been intrigued by the degree to which the royal family themselves attract this fascination, given that we'd hardly know them. They are caricatures, really. And now this couple who aren't really part of it anymore are even more famous, curiously. Um, so it is interesting in that sense. Clearly, the British press have it in for the duo. Um, and that uh, my sympathies are wholly with them, the duo. And well, why do you think the British press have got it in for them? Partly because they've taken on newspapers in ways that I think are wholly legitimate. I know there's an issue, look, they use the newspapers to promote themselves. But that doesn't mean, actually, that newspapers then have the right to hammer them at every moment. And I think there are echoes there, and he clearly feels it, with Diana and what happened to her. And I just don't think the British newspapers should have the right to destroy people or appear to destroy them. So in that sense, um, I think they have every right to feel aggrieved and to express themselves. I mean, it's up to us whether we watch it and get excited by it. I, I can promise you, I love celebrity. I'm not excited by it. Um, but I know there will be global hysteria over it, which in itself is quite interesting too.